50-50 chance they got lost or stolen or they might appear somewhere. I'm stressed. At this point, UPS and FedEx are the final boss of sneaker purchases. Have a brick, hold a brick. <laughs> Yo, boy, I'm almost off. They won, bro. This is the second time I get my package stolen. If y'all remember, a month ago, I tried buying a pair of Cause 4s on eBay. They just disappeared into thin air. Hey, yo, what the fuck? The same shit happened again, but this time with GOAT. In this video, I'm gonna break down everything that happened, so make sure y'all watch to the end. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel. Let me know if this has ever happened to you. This all started on July 18th. I was looking through GOAT for sneakers. I I placed an offer on the Jordan 1 Travis Scott Olives. It's a pair of kicks that I've been wanting for a minute. I said, you know what? They're at a good price. Placed my offer at 677 and the seller accepted. At this point, I'm gassed. I'm like, all right, I'm gonna get my pair of sneakers in a couple weeks. I'm gonna just leave the app to the side. Everything's great. Fast forward a week, it says the package is at the GOAT facility. So I'm like, okay, we're making progress. My sneakers should be here within a week or so. Check the app again in a couple days and it went from a waiting authentic to shipment delay. I'm like, what's going on, bro? They didn't even authenticate them. So there's something fishy, bro. That's when I start panicking a little bit. I'm like, yo, coming fresh off that cause Jordan 4 situation, I'm already expecting the worst. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. So I'm being patient. I'm like, bro, there's literally nothing I could do. Days pass, bro. I'm talking about like five days pass. And it starts saying shipment delay. Now I'm searching on Reddit. I'm like, bro, what's going on with my order? That's when I started seeing a 50-50 chance Chance got lost or stolen or they might appear somewhere at this point it's like july 28 what's going on with my sneakers i literally gave y'all almost 700 dollars and this pair of sneakers is nowhere to be found like this does not make no sense so i'm panicking i start watching youtube videos of people getting their shit robbed or stolen by fedex and ups they're talking about the only way to reach goat is by tweeting them or hitting them up on social media so i'm like bet you feel me that's what i do this is what I'm here for. I'm gonna show y'all all the email receipts after the sponsorship of this video, Poison. A lot of us are sick and tired of getting played by eBay, GOAT, and StockX. That's why a fresh and new brand is necessary in the sneaker game. They have a huge selection of products. And when I found this pair of kicks, I was gassed. Look at the packaging. It comes bubble wrapped in a box inside the bag with the box inside of it. Like, bro, this is what those other brands need to be doing. I decided to pick up the Travis Scott Air Force Ones, size nine and a half. Price they had them listed at was actually pretty good. Poison authentication certificate. Cactus Jack paper on the inside. Let's take these out real quick because I'm excited to see them. Extra laces. Personally, I'm gonna use the cream color. These Travis Air Forces are beautiful. I'm so glad to finally have these in the collection. I love the buckle on the back. Different tones that they have are just so clean to me. If you guys didn't know, Poison is actually one of the first websites to the develop authentication before delivery service. That's one of the beautiful things about it. Ton of different products on their website and it's all gonna be authentic. They've actually authenticated over 350 million products. They have a catalog of over 300,000 authenticated items they could refer to when sellers are sending in their product for authentication. I was looking for these for a minute and I'm glad I found them at a good price. Poison authentication, zip tie, can't stop, won't stop on the other side with the QR. Can't stop, won't stop buying from Poison. I know I'm gonna get my sh on time and it's gonna be great quality when I get it. It's a no brainer. They don't just have Travis Scott's, they have recent releases like the Jordan 1 Low Black Toe, Jordan 4 SBs, ton of variety. I definitely recommend you guys to check them out. Don't sleep and try Poison with the link at the top of the description. You'll have a chance to win $50 off your first purchase and even $100 cash back. It's a win win. If you're looking into buying some kicks, check out Poison. But let's get back to GOAT stealing my package at that point i tweet at them bro i basically said my order stuck on shipment delay after was waiting for verification what does that even mean for real like bro how you backtrack they actually tweeted back at me they're like oh we're sorry there's something going on with you thank you for tweeting in this that and the third dm us your information and we'll take a look i'm like i right, bet you know what let me dm them. boom sent them all my information they told me to wait a day or two and they would email me updates on the order basically 
go emailed me talking about due to the heavy influx of orders that we got going on, give us a little bit of time to process. I'm like, okay, you know what? I'll give y'all the benefit of the doubt. Hopefully that's the case. I'm gonna just end up waiting and see what happens. This lady basically said she hit up the operation team and she was gonna try to figure it out, which gave me a little bit of hope, bro. I emailed her back saying, thank you for checking into it, blah, blah, blah. Basically, I've been having a lot of issues buying sneakers, this, that, and the third. That's what I said. And the next day I get a notification from GOAT, bro. I'm like, what is going on now, bro? August 3rd, they basically said, listen, bro, we gonna have to give you your money back. Your package has been misplaced, lost, stolen, whatever you wanna call it. That's what I heard in my head, bro. I'm like, yo, my shit got stolen again. What the f bro this cannot be real i'm sick like dead ass sick that was around the time travis scott dropped his album so those prices started going up a little bit i'm like nah bro like this is just cruelty beyond the meats bro like i'm straight up stressing at this point they automatically filed a claim on the order that was on go i'm gonna put a screenshot right here for y'all but they filed a claim gave me my refund like within three to four days and that was it bro if you want a free chance to win a pair of Jordan 1 Low Black Toes, click the link in the description. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel and follow one Nori on Instagram. Don't miss out on a free pair of black toes in your size. My sneakers disappeared. Thankfully, I got my money back. I low-key try to hit them with the same shit I hit eBay with. Like, yo, because of the inconvenience, could I get some type of money? Like a little credit or something? The lady wasn't having none of it, bro. She literally just reassured me that my original money was going to come to me. And that's it, bro. They didn't give me no credit. They ain't do nothing special for me after waiting damn near three weeks to have no sneakers it's just disappointing bro because when you spend a lot of money on these big companies or corporations you expect they're gonna take care of you at least keep you updated the bare minimum type shit and it just didn't work that way so it's hard bro like it's honestly difficult when you want to buy these luxury items and you want to treat yourself at the end of the day and you can't even do that the right way because ups and fedex are playing football with your pack packages bro they're just taking shit and running with it i'm not even gonna lie bro somebody need to see what's going on especially with ups drivers now making 170k a year bro you don't need my sneakers leave my sneakers alone bro no bullshit but that's basically what happened with the goat jordan one travis scott olive horror story that i got going on i'm not gonna lie to y'all my dumb ass tried again on goat we're gonna see how that goes if i actually end up getting them y'all gonna be seeing that video soon if i don't y'all gonna see a part two to this video they not about to get off scot free bro like we on day next bro i told you if some bullshit it happens to me buying sneakers i'm a document it every single step of the way i appreciate y'all for making it this far into the video if you enjoyed this one please leave a like bro all i ask is a like for the stress that i've been going through trying to buy these hype sneakers also in the comments let me know what's your favorite travis scott jordan one high or low don't forget to check out poison link is at the top of the description you can get yourself some money off on some shoes that you already want and even win a hundred dollars of cash back trust me you will not regret it just go ahead and check them out it definitely helps out the channel check out this video right here because that's what youtube is recommending you based on what you've been watching you could even check out this video when i lost my jordan 4 calls from ebay that was crazy and all that being said i appreciate y'all i love y'all i'ma catch y'all there peace